card is issued to give a unique identification number which is established nationally and permanently. It helps in monitoring the transactions of high amount to somehow evade taxes. Income tax department is responsible to issue PAN cards under the guidelines set by Central Board for Direct Taxes or CBDT. Many application processes like bank accounts, registration proofs, property booking, investments and other business require the use of PAN card. Hence, it is an important identity proof especially for NRIs. The Indian government made it compulsory for even NRIs to enroll under PAN cards and have an account number for any payments due to income tax department and to quote that number in every other document related to finances. There are four types of documents that should be enclosed along with PAN application form for NRIs. They are firstly for identification proof. There should be a photocopy of passport or Aadhaar card or driving license or voter ID. Second for address proof, there should be a photocopy of passport or bank account statement of the resident country or NRE bank account statement which shows a minimum of two transactions within the last six months. It should also be attested by Indian Embassy or Consular Office or High Commission or Apostle or even the bank manager. Third, two passport size photographs. It should be colored with black and white background. And fourth, the acknowledgement form. Now, all these documents should be affixed with the applicant's signature or the left thumb impression while filing the information and personal details on the form the application form also has a column for a request for new pan card or changes or correction in pan data hence the applicant uh, can correct their personal details on that this can be done by offline uh, visiting the uti tsl nsdl center or online through the website NRIs who are Indian citizens are required to fill form 49A and NRIs who have foreign citizenship should fill form 49AA. Also, it would be beneficial if a qualified and well-informed financial investor after the form is submitted, the applicant will receive an acknowledgement receipt. This receipt along with the photocopy of the document should be posted on the NSDL center within 15 days. After this, the applicant can track their status with the help of the acknowledgement number via online mode. Hence, through this process, an NRI can apply for the application of PAN card through online or offline mode. Thank you.